Hey everyone, it's Carolyn. Um, I just wanted to make a video on tips for solo hiking. Um, I do go hiking or just kind of trail walking on my own quite a bit. So I just wanted to kind of share some tips with you um, that I use myself. So my first tip is to definitely dress or pack for the weather. Um, on this particular trip, it ended up being really rainy and it was only supposed to be cloudy. Um, but by packing a extra pair of anything basically you know I brought an extra pair of shoes and socks and pants shirt I brought everything um, I kept those things in the car so I don't have to lug those around with me um, but it is a good idea to just make sure you have um, at least the weather in mind when you are packing for that day my next tip is to prepare enough snacks and water to get you through your trip if you know you're going on a short trip um, you can pack a little lighter than if you were going for something that would take a few hours. Just be sure to remember that there's nobody going to be there who is going to help you out with food. Um, you're not going to have friends to mooch off of. So you got to like really think about what you need to sustain your energy levels and stuff for when you, um, for your entire trip. My third tip is to definitely let people know where you're going to be. Um, you know, I always make sure to leave a note, um, let my parents know where I'm going to be. You can always check in at the local ranger station before you get to these trails. Um, as long as someone knows where you're going to be so you can be accounted for um, in case like people can't communicate with you or like you're out of service area and people are just kind of concerned. Um, Another sub tip for that is to go to a place that you're familiar with. Maybe pick a trail that you've already been to before rather than trying somewhere new. If you are trying somewhere new and you feel pretty confident in your like navigation skills and your, you know, um, hiking skills, at least just let someone know where you're going to be. Um, my fourth tip is if you can't bring a human companion, try and bring an animal. Um, I always bring my dog. I didn't for this particular trip, um, but I usually try and take my dog with me just because I, yeah, I talk to my dog. Um, yeah, he's just someone to talk to. Just remember, if you are bringing an animal, be sure to bring enough food and water for them as well. My fifth and final tip is to definitely have fun. Enjoy yourself. You're there to enjoy nature. You know, feel free to like, you don't have to use electronics if you don't want to, but take selfies, have fun, enjoy yourself. So that's all I have for this video. Feel free to leave a comment below if you have any suggestions or add-ons to add to these. Um, yeah, like, subscribe, stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching. Bye.